All right, another way to do solo training is, of course, with, the, with equipment. I'll get a little TJ here right now. You can also use tires and all kinds of stuff. I have more stuff I'll be bringing out later on. But we're going to start on TJ. We want to work, or at least go through, the 12 strikes. Now, I like TJ because he's made of rubber, and he, he will bounce. So we have to be always be aware of the disposition of TJ here. All right, so again, we start. One, two. Now, one and two, these are going to the ears. The ears give you a general area of where to strike a good target. Because that takes care of the temple, and most of you are jawline. Jawline. Three, from the kneecap. TJ doesn't have any knees, so we have to improvise. And we'll go right up the bottom. Boom, striking upwards. Four, we start in the knees, going all the way up the body. Five, to the groin, poor TJ has no groin as well. Twisting, striking, oh luckily he doesn't, depending on your disposition. And of course this can go all the way up to the line. Your basic idea for this strike is to the groin, can go right up by the belly button, down chin if you use that word. Six, floating ribs. Seven, floating ribs. Eight, crown of the head. Now nine is gonna, gonna be swinging up to the throat. This is a sangeke, this is a stabbing, a bunyo. Ten, bunyo, sangeke to the other side, right to the throat, oh my goodness. Gotta practice that. Eleven, this is another circular strike to the crown of the head, right down the crown of the head. And 12, we come up, bridge of the nose, crown of the head. So that gives you an idea of where they go. We can also practice these with a partner. If we practice with a partner, we usually stay about quite a bit away. I have four sets, I have squares in the floor, I say two squares away. So that way nobody gets hit in the head, which is probably a good thing, probably something you want to think about doing. All right, so we're going to do some more work with the 12 in just a second. All right, so I'll get them. This time we're gonna use this piece of old equipment here. And it can be, this can be anything. I just want an arm sticking out. Why do I want the arm sticking out? Because I want a place to focus. Now, if you notice my eyes, they go off that way. Most people's eyes go that way, mine goes that way. So, focusing on distances can be quite challenging for me can be quite a challenge, challenge for anyone if you're do, doing drugs like this. So again, from here, I'm just going to work my diagonal strikes right on the end. Now again, so see, I should be hitting each time, but again, I'm working my distancing. And we start to work all these guys. So this is a little solo training. Solo training is always good, especially if you have no one to work with. That kind of makes sense, doesn't it? And we can use all these, all different kinds of equipment. Just to get these. And again, I can use offensive or I can start to use my defensive. If I want to close, I could either say this is, is my opponent and close right over here. Start to work my defensive footwork, striking on the arm, striking to the body. Go to the opposite side. When I use my defensive footwork against the strikes, and I'll, I'll explain more of this later, you actually want to get the most out of the exercise. So if I'm moving to this side, I'll start with moving my left foot front, so I can move the right foot in front here. If I'm going to the other side, I'll start with the right foot in front, so I can move the left foot there. But again, back to our diagonal strikes. You can focus on those any way you want. Working on your depth perception, speed, power. Oh, there he goes. Many different ways. We'll be turning many different ways. If you have a partner, you can. Usually, I don't like to bang sticks, but for coordination and depth perception, it could be a good thing. The drill I'll be teaching you later on, two-person drill. 
we actually stop off banging sticks just so we can get distance and not hurt each other because safety first, right? All righty then.